couple of the things that I look for initially are calls to action. You've got a great call to action. You've got your phone number. Um, it's linked, which is good. So if I mouse over, you can actually click on it. A couple minor changes that we want to know, uh, or that we want that we want to look for, are the call to action in the hero or the header image here is a primary. What do you want to be known for, and what do you want people to search for and find you? So IT professionals for small businesses. If that is the primary keyword, that's what we need to target. I don't think that is going to be the primary keyword, but I'm going to do a little digging and see if something like Fresno IT services, Fresno outsourced IT services, managed IT services in Fresno, those types of keywords I think might be a little more specific because just IT professionals for small businesses don't have a geographic modifier like Fresno. And so you're literally targeting the whole world and you're not gonna be able to compete with the whole world and you serve a local clientele. So narrowing down that primary keyword is what we wanna do. On the homepage, we wanna use it a couple different times. Um, we also wanna adjust this menu bar here to have the primary most important thing on the left, the least important thing onto the right. So dynamic services, dynamic 360, dark web search, then about and contact. So those are all changes that we can make. As I scroll through the page, we want to focus on packaged IT services in Fresno, Fresno packaged IT services. Um, we wanna talk about how we serve Fresno and Clovis and Kingsburg and Kerman and wherever else you focus we want to make sure that we're actually talking about each of those cities. So you've got your address here. That says Fresno. You've got Fresno a couple times on the page, but having some of those specific keywords, we do Fresno IT services, Fresno managed IT work, whatever that keyword is that we find that people are searching for. Another quick on-site analysis, you've got a good short title, 53 characters. Again, putting the most important keyword here, Fresno's most reliable IT pros is good marketing jargon, but it's not good SEO jargon for Google. So dynamic tech designs, perfect, that's your brand. Then Fresno's best outsourced out or managed IT services, whatever we wanna have here. So top tier IT services and cybersecurity in the Central Valley. Again, this is good marketing, but not good for Google. Nobody's gonna search Central Valley. They're gonna search their city. Uh, so your domain is indexed. You've got no H1 tags, but you do have some H2 and three. The H1 tag is typically what Google's gonna look at and say, what is this page about? So we come over here to headings. You start with H2. H2 has no keywords. H2 has kind of a keyword, IT solutions. Uh, H2 with no keywords, H2 with no keywords. So we wanna tell Google, what is this site about? And Google wants to know from a heading, this site is about Fresno IT services, IT services in Fresno. So we wanna adjust those a little bit. You've got good links, some internal, some external, that's fine. Um, keywords, some without alt tags, we wanna update those if there's an alt tag. Moving over to your organic keywords, um, one major issue I have right here is everything that you rank for, and this is just what uh, hrefs shows that you rank for, everything is on page two or beyond. Page one is one through 10, page two is 11 through 20. The problem with ranking on page two is obviously nobody's gonna see anything. A uh, secondary problem is this could be Google looking at your site and saying your site is no good, or it could be Google looking at your site and saying, I just don't know what your site's about. So getting those keywords updated would be the first step towards trying to rank better. Another on-site um, issue that I see is you don't have any referring domains, literally four. Those are a rapid DNS, which is probably not anything. Yeah, it's just showing who's on your um, domain. All of Madeira is a nonprofit you support. 
California list is probably just a directory. Yep, they've just got you listed. And Dynamic Tech Designs, I imagine, is another domain you own that is 301 redirected. Yeah, so there's the redirect there. So you don't have any links outside of all of Madera.com. So getting some additional links will be helpful. Another thing that I noticed is when I search Dynamic TD Fresno, I don't find a lot about you. I find your website has a double listing. You have an unclaimed Google My Business, so it doesn't have the information you put up there because you haven't claimed it yet. And then if I look through the search results, I've got a bunch of stuff about the Bulldogs because we've got stuff about Fresno. TD is another word for touchdown. So we've got a bunch of Derek Carr highlights. We've got Fresno State Bulldogs football highlights. And we even get down into Yellow Pages and Yellow Pages doesn't have anything about you. Um, we do work with another company that has a service that goes through and claims all of these listings. So you could get claimed on you know, Google My Business and Yelp and Yellow Pages and all of these other directories. And the nice thing about that is all of those directories on their own don't do much, but as a whole, they tell Google that you are a real business with a real address that should be trusted. And that's really what we're looking for from a large scale is this is not what we want to see, a double listing and then totally unrelated stuff throughout the rest of the page. So that would be a good suggestion. I think it's like 50 bucks a month. Uh, I, I'd have to double check, but if you're interested, let me know. But we definitely want to get these things claimed. We want to get Google Analytics installed so that we can see who's coming to your site, from where they're coming, what they're doing on your site, and having a path of what the customer is doing, where they're entering, where they're exiting, and where there may be some friction um, with their visit. And then the last thing is you mentioned that you're a Dell Premier Partner, uh, IT Management Services supported by Kaseya and Webroot. So we'll make sure we get some of those logos or links or at least some verbiage on the website. Having things like Dell, Kaseya, Webroot, they lend credibility to you because you are one of their vendors. And so their name recognition transfers well over to you. So a couple of those things will get taken care of. If you have any questions, let me know. If you are interested in getting all of those citations claimed and getting all of that updated, uh, let me know and I'll get an exact price for you and get that taken care of.